to search every gas station, residence, warehouse, farmhouse, hen house, outhouse, dog house until they find his backpack. Wait a minute, I think that's the wrong movie. Never mind. Hey, it's Brickzar! I'm going to do another Lego train review. Another 9 volt Lego train. We have here set 10158, a Lego World City high speed passenger train car. This is um, a car that matches with set 10157, the high speed dummy locomotive, and then 4511, which was the complete set with track. So you added these to those sets. In fact, they give you a lot of the same things with this set as they do with the actual set 4511. Same minifigures, except this one you do get a new one that's not in the other sets. It's Timmy. And I'm actually missing a piece with this set, but we're going to go ahead and review it. I've placed an order with Bricklink about four days ago. The seller has not responded uh, for the one piece that I'm missing. It's actually, there's only 13 sellers, I think, even had the piece that I'm looking for. So, Let's review it, and we'll start with those minifigures show, so that I can show you what I'm missing. Now, you get two minifigures, and one of them is this crazy-eyed Timmy. And he's got the freckles and the... I'm not suspicious look. He's got a camera, and he's got a backpack. But unfortunately, that is the piece I'm missing. Uh, the backpack I gave him is actually a bigger backpack, more conspicuous. But uh, it's the standard backpack, but... They don't make it in that color, except in this set and one other set. I think it was light bluish gray, or light gray. I can't remember which one. It doesn't matter which color. I just I wanted to get the gray, light gray or gray, um, light bluish gray to go with this set, so it'd be more like the one that it actually came with. So, it's kind of a plain legs and torso, but uh, yeah, crazy eyed Timmy has the wrong backpack. Here's the other minifigure. Now this one is actually in set 4511 as well. It's like the secret agent or undercover policeman. Actually, I think it's somebody from Men in Black. It's Tommy Lee Jones. He's got a shield. That's what this little piece is here. His little police shield. They put it in those, the suitcase. And, you know, he's concerned because Timmy... Timmy has the wrong backpack. So he's wanting everybody to... To search every gas station, residence, warehouse, farmhouse, hen house, outhouse, dog house, until they find his backpack. Wait a minute, I think that's the wrong movie. Never mind. So again, these passenger trains, they have a simple build. They have faux doors. This is actually what the door is supposed to be right there. Um, then you got all these windows. This is second class or steerage. Uh, the engine, for some reason, is first class, but you know, your second class, you're next to the cargo. I guess it's quieter than being next to the engine. Uh, the cargo is suitcase. <laughs> There's a gray suitcase in there, but not Timmy's backpack. We'll pretend that never happened. All right, it's real easy to put together. I like all the trans black windows there. They make the tops e easy to remove. They're not even connected at all. And you got the coffee cups and all the chairs to put your characters in there. Which is what we'll do now. Timmy can't fit in there with this backpack. So he needs the right backpack. So we'll take that backpack off. We'll put him in there. And we'll put Tommy Lee Jones on the other side. And knock this coffee cup over. Throw a suitcase in there. So that's, again, that's what the inside looks like. It's got faux doors on the ends, but not on this end. And the cargo does come off. That piece just comes off. So a forklift or something, stick its forks through there and pull that piece off. And then you can easily put these little roof pieces back on. So there's not a lot of pieces to it. It's a real easy build. You could probably change it to 
a different color if you wanted to. Just take all those green bricks and swap them out with uh, a different color. And you could make a different color passenger train. It'd be real simple to do if you wanted to. But it's got the stickers on here. Your power, pneumatics, oil, and water. They didn't do that. I wouldn't know what it was in water, oil, pneumatics, and power. So that is the passenger train. That's the car, 10158. It goes with 10157, which is one we looked at in the previous video. And then you go, we're going to eventually combine it with 4511 and have a complete bullet train or whatever kind of high-speed passenger train you call it. So again, another add-on to your LEGO collection from 2004, I believe. This World City passenger train. I think it looks pretty good actually. Uh, we'll eventually compare it to the uh, ICE tr ICE train. I always want to call it ICE train but everybody in Europe yells at me. Um, anyway this is the high-speed passenger train and we've been looking at the car previously looked at the engine and now we got to get the other set put them all together. Anyway, thanks for watching Hope you liked the video. Hope you're loving the train reviews and the look at the trains in our collection. And we got more coming. Thanks for watching. It's Brigsar.